Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your June 3rd through, through the 17th, June 17th reading. Um, it's a bi-weekly reading. Yes, it's a little late, but I'm here to do it. Alright, so let's get started. We'll save the announcements to the end. First row is love and romance. Okay, so five cards spread, two cards came out for your main obstacle. Uh, first card is you, right where you are, the four of pentacles. Some of you could be holding on to how you feel, holding back, um, not wanting to fully invest in a situation. Uh, guarding yourself, guarding your heart. You've been through a lot here. Are you on your correct path? Five of Swords. Ooh. You might be trying to get there with the five of swords maybe you're trying to get to the six of swords peace and serenity there may be heavy arguing uh you might be trying to hurt each other whomever your each other is whomever your significant partner is in your life there there's heavy verbal battle there's also action um this type of energy doesn't come without outside interference in the playing cards deck the five of spade which is the same card completely talks about outside interference it could be that you know you leo or your partner has a third party or mother-in-law father-in-law cousin sister brother is interfering which is causing the energy to be heavy and argumentative and uh hostile and volatile at this point um, I would say no you're not on your correct path by way of the cards and your main obstacle the two of pentacles and then the ace of wands so this is your obstacle you have two very real options here they've manifested because they're pentacle and they're real they're solid they're here it's just that you have to be motivated to to choose to be at the two of wands be actually moving in a direction of whatever or or whomever this is your obstacle is that um you might be involved in a love affair or a business relationship that's just not it's not good it's not you know favorable <clears throat> you have to have the motivation to get yourself out of that in a sense or move away from or transform the energy or get creative here What's helping you? The Seven of Pentacles. Investments. Um, some of you could be... This is love and romance. What's helping you is... You haven't left the situation because you've invested a lot in it. Or vice versa. Someone has invested a lot in you. A lot of time, energy, money, love, whatever. And they just don't want to easily walk away. Because we know as people... When we invest in something or someone, we want to return on that. So it's very, it's not very, but it's a bit difficult to just walk away. You know? Capricorn Virgo Taurus here. How can progress be made? Ace of Cups. Um, love for self first. Ace of Cups. let the emotions pour let the love flow in the midst of this relationship start over in love restore the love have new love and new friendship for each other maybe with a cancer pisces scorpio career and finance all right Oh, excuse me, the bottom of the deck, Ten of Cups. So, the ultimate and the highest level of happiness. This could be a family. This could be a marriage. This could be, you know, family with children. The Ace of Cups, the Ten of Cups, um, Seven of Pentacles. Definitely, this is this is a, an established relationship. This isn't someone you just met last week. Um... How you get back to the highest level of happiness is to restore the love. But you've got to start with self first. If you don't love yourself, in, not in that superficial way, but love for self like 
I won't tolerate this and I won't allow that and I won't do this and I won't do that love for self starts there and then you can start giving outward love uh, and this can be restored all right career and finance ace of pentacles nice is right where you are three of wands are you on your correct path it looks like no you're trying to start something new either business or a new job or just a new way of making money you're walking away from an old way an old partnership <clears throat> you're looking out to your horizons and or you're waiting for your investments to come back in so you could be at the four of wands uh, the need for well not the need but the uh, opportunity for celebration and having created something solid and stable for yourself yeah. obstacle main obstacle two cards fell out again king of swords and the eight of swords for some of you you feel trapped stuck maybe to a gemini libra aquarius typically this is libra or aquarius eight of swords you just can't see a way out you just keep thinking about this person you just can't see a way out of being bound to this person or this job or this career this could be a boss you just you want to please them there's no pleasing them eight of swords What's helping you? Four of Wands, nice. Uh, stability. Creating that stability for yourself. I think it's outside of whatever you're doing for career and finance. How can progress be made? Lay down the burden. The burden may be uh, a job that you're at. You might. This might be a change of career completely. Um, start of a new business. It's burdensome to to be where you are in your career. You're looking at long-term stability with the Ace of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. Your stability may be, and your money may be tied into a relationship also. And you're trying to figure out how can I walk away, still maintain, myself financially for some of my Leo men and my Leo women eight seven of pentacles at the bottom of the deck yeah you're looking back at what you've invested in or what someone has invested in you you want to return on this investment um, also you've invested in something a new career a hobby a business and, and it's here and now it's time to celebrate uh, the fruits of your labor coming in, your harvest. Okay. All right, cards of advice. Welcome the new. Yeah, there's newness here with the Ace of Pentacles. It might be a new job, new, new business, new way of making money. A large sum of money comes in. Religion and spirituality, Ace of Cups. It looks like to restore a certain situation, you're going to have to rely heavily on spirit with the ace of cups um, to have the courage with this ace of wands to either make a decision about which path you're you're moving in for some of my leos and love and romance heavenly signs all right uh, they're here for you spirit is with the ace of cups once again is working with you to let you know that um you need to do this you need to you need to work on this um putting people in your path that can help that will give a word of advice are you listening bottom of the deck new career yeah i think you some of you in career and finance are walking away from an old way of making money and you're going to embark on something new here and it's something you're already doing something you've already you know been weighing up the two of pentacles also um it looks really good so leo if this resonated with you please like share comment subscribe to the channel it's much appreciated uh for the next two weeks it looks pretty good <clears throat> 
especially in career and finance uh, love you're gonna have to work on that you know and work on letting someone know what happened to you in your past whether I mean instead of fighting you've got to lay down the sword you've got to open up emotionally and be open to counseling and help okay all right so there you are um leo all of my information is below how to request a reading send me an email um we'll get you scheduled leo remember when in doubt pray i am praying for you pray for me as well take care until the mid june readings take advantage of the 20 dollars special 20 dollars will get you three clear questions okay it should be clear concise all right all right so i will talk to you guys soon